Hi everyone, I'm back with another fashion haul and this is going to be, I think, a pretty big haul. So I'm going to try and get through it really quickly. So let's just get straight into it. So the first item that I want to show you is this colour Block Blouse from Bardo. Um, I really like it because it's got, you know, the black and the um, ivory colour block and it's... The buttons are covered. I know that there's a special term for that, but I don't can't remember off the top of my head what that is. And it's got these pale pink um, little cuff sleeves, which are really cute. Um, this is a slightly longer at the back, so it's a little bit of a high-low hem. Um, this one retails for $69.95, but um, my boyfriend's sister's friend um, had a family friends family and friends discount for 40% um, off, so I got this for 40% off, which is great. Okay, and I went shopping um, on Bridge Road recently in Richmond, and if you live in Melbourne, you'll know that that's quite a popular place to go shopping. Um, I went into this random store and I actually don't remember what it was called but if I do remember I'll put it in the bottom bar. Um, they had everything, um, almost everything, two items for $50 or one for $29. So I bought this really pretty dress and it's got like these um, little triangular cutouts um, and I really really like this. It's sort of got that... Um, boho feel to it um, and it's a suede material and I've seen this kind of dress before for like quite expensive and so I was wrapped that I was able to get this for 25 bucks so that was a steal. The other item that I bought from that store to make up the $50 is this color block knit and it's just um, a really sort of oversized um, comfortable knit. It's got cuffed sleeves as well. Now I went to Kmart recently and I actually don't mind their clothes there. Um, they usually have quite affordable, um, you know, trendy looking clothes. So I went there and I got this very basic um, oatmeal cardigan. Um, I got this mainly to wear to work because I thought, you know, it's a nice colour and I don't have this kind of colour cardigan. Um, and this was $12. And if you watched my last, I think it was my last haul, my last fashion haul, um, I spoke about how I ordered a khaki jacket from JV Style for you. They sent me the wrong size and I just, um, they've just disappeared off the face of the earth and they won't send me the correct size or refund me or anything like that. So, um... Apart from the fact that I hate JP Style for you now, um, I still wanted to look for a khaki jacket. Um, so at Kmart I saw this one. And this one looks much better on than on the hanger. Um, I really like it because it's got these drawstrings so that you can actually, um, it can be more fitted to your body. Um, and this was only $29 so I've been looking for a khaki and rack for a while. Um, this has got little cuffed sleeves as well with the button. Um, the only thing with this is it's it's quite thin so it's not very warm but you know for $29 you can't really complain. Now recently I also um, did some online shopping on alleyfashion.com.au Ali I think it is. Um, they have physical stores in Melbourne as well but um, I it's sort of not really conveniently located for me so I from time to time I buy from their website and I've been looking for winter shorts that I can wear with tights and you know stuff like that and I don't really have any so I bought these and I really really like these they're burgundy um, sort of suede material little high waist shorts and it's got the two exposed zippers the only thing is um, when this arrived, I realised that this zip is faulty. It doesn't zip all the way up. It's got that gap um, and it doesn't seal itself properly. Um, so I've asked them to send me a reply paid envelope so I can exchange this. Um, but I really, really like this. This was $25. So the other shorts I bought are these. And um, it's got a metallic sort of lace finish to it. Um, I envision to wear this with 
like oversized comfy knits and stuff like that um, with tights um, so I think that will look really cute um, I also just filmed um, a lookbook um, featuring this vest um, so I will and, and this was featured in that lookbook so I will link that for you here and I'm also wearing that um, this outfit in that lookbook as well and this was $25 I also went to Dotty and I bought this little winter skirt and I have been looking for a winter skirt as well um, in not black because I've only got black skirts for some reason um, so I got this um, little woolen skirt and I like the colour because it goes with lots of things and I like the little skinny belt as well and it's sort of slightly high waisted um, this retails for $49.95 but um, I think that it, yeah this was $20 off so I got this for $30 also at Dottie I bought this gorgeous velvet dress and I've actually been looking for a dress like this um, and I'll strap that this was also on sale. It retails for $69.95 and it was $20 or $30 off, I don't remember now. Actually I think I got it for $50. So I really really like that and I usually wouldn't go for this emerald green kind of colour but I tried it on and it, I guess it matches my skin tone. So I'm really looking forward to wearing that. I'm really liking velvet this season. Um, and I used to hate velvet, but for some reason it's grown on me. And I bought, went to IDS and I bought these velvet leggings. Um, they're just your normal leggings. I really, really like them. Um, and yes, I would wear them as pants, but I wouldn't wear, you know, a short little top with it. Um, I have made a um, how to wear leggings with pants video. So I'll link that for you here. Um, this was $25 and they're super comfy. Now I went to Tempt um, last night and I was absolutely wrapped to spot this fur, leopard print fur jacket. Um, it was $35. And like I've seen this kind of jacket before for like over $100 and this was on sale. It retails for $69.95 um, and I got it on sale for $34.95. So I can't wait to wear this as well. I definitely don't think it looks like it costs $34.95. Um, so yeah, and this will keep me really warm. Now I also went shopping on ASOS and I saw these cute little silver flats. Um, I think these were $30. And what I like about these is that this little bow is an actual metal bow. It's not like a flimsy little ribbon or anything. So I thought they would look super cute um, with just, you know, a pair of jeans and stuff. Um, and a knit look really cute in winter and it's got a snake print um, kind of finish to it oh and I also forgot to mention at Dotty I bought this chain necklace and I've been looking for a chain necklace for a while this was not on sale it was $19.95 but I mean I liked it a lot and I usually wouldn't pay um, too much for jewelry but um, I liked it so much that I bought it anyway and I also bought this little bangle, actually my boyfriend bought this for me, um, from Carbon. And I think it's really cute, it's got a little um, heart charm, and I think this is like 8 or $9. Now before I go, I wanted to mention that um, I tried out this Press and Go nails, and um, I actually quite like it. It's very easy to apply, and at first I thought it looked tacky, but I've had some compliments, so... I really really like this. I got this in my Priceline um, free bag when I spent $60 um, and I went to buy some more last night and I realized that they retail for $14.95 which I think is really expensive because it's it's enough for two wears um, so yeah that's really expensive but let me know if you like these or not. I think they're kind of cute. So that concludes my whole video. I did that super super fast because my battery is about to die and my boyfriend is hungry. So I better go now. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.